Hello, oh. welcome. Welcome back, General Chat. We are in the Dragon's Den, in the mm -hmm. back corner of Meltdown Comics. Is it the Dragon's Den or just Dragon's Den? Either. Take your pick. Either. Tax is either. As long as you visit. Meltdown Comics, if you're not familiar, we're here in the greater Los Angeles area on Sunset. Hollywood. If you live nearby, uh -huh. and this mm -hmm. is your, your place to come, come on in. We'll give you, the, you get a discount if you name us. 10% off. Not you. us, not us. Just not us. Cinema say Realm. Our Cinema spirit Realm. will be with you. Yeah. You say, you get 10 Cinema Realm sent me. New comics and holiday deals here at the Dragon's Den. So, so go and, and spend money because that's what I'll be doing this Christmas. So I've already got my Christmas gift picked out for myself. Mm -hmm. Ooh, he's getting a cleric. I'm getting it. Well, yeah, I don't think it's officially a cleric, but I'm going to be using him as a cleric. And then I'm going to get some other he's stuff around the store for It's you. It's your role playing as a cleric. Every, every week we come here, I spend at least like $60. Talk about I gotta... videos. <gasps> Videos, that's what we do on this channel. Oh, what I videos? Be I just want to touch the beard. Oh, okay. Bit. See, he doesn't touch your beard. I guess it's of a different texture. It's, not never, a, that's not, it's coarse. That's Yours weird. Is, this is a weird, weird episode. This is uh, all right, what videos this week? What's going on? Um, well, because Christmas is just a couple days away, uh, I think you should open up all of your Christmas games and then make videos of them and then send them to me. It doesn't matter what they are. I just want to get the joy in your voice. Of Christmas cheer. What if they open a, black, a copy of Black Ops? No. And then they send that in. You can go to hell if you get Black Ops for Christmas. How about a Nintendo 64, like the little N64 kid? How about that? Can you do that? Well, it depends on what game. What on the N64? So I'm hoping they can make an N64 game with... Someone gets Quest maybe... 64. And yeah. they open that. For some reason, their parents got them a game that's like 12 years old. <laughs> well, because they're, dig they're out really your, poor. Dig out into your old VHS. Found it at the garage sale. All right, that's yeah. fair. Maybe, maybe you'll have something in for your... Yeah, I don't know. Let's go to questions. I don't care. <laughs> All right, our first question comes from Nedlex. Who's right. asked questions on constantly? Nedlex. Nedlex. Mm -hmm. I'm glad you learned his name. Uh, yes. <laughs> Long RPGs for the 3DS. A good idea or OMG, my eyes are bleeding idea. Have you ever like, played any of the Zelda on the DS? Things like that, or oh, yeah. Final Fantasy on the um, DS? Was it? What was the one that was on the DS like two or three years ago? It was pretty cute. It was like the. It was like Wind Waker animated, and it was pretty cool, and I liked that about it. Oh yeah. But I don't know, like, I don't, I don't own a DS, but I, I used to play on one. I can't stare at that screen for too long. Yeah, no, and especially with the the 3D eye popping thing, it's supposed to gonna kill little kids' eyes. I'm sure it's not gonna be a, a great idea. But yeah. I'm already burning out my eyes with radiation from my monitor playing WoW. Just play a. I, I can't, I can't lose any more eyesight. Too. Yeah. You don't have to play long RPGs on a DS. Play long RPGs on your 3D. Monitor on your computer, like Mass Effect, you can do that. For yeah. the holidays, on a holiday trip, I'm going home. I won't have my tower. I'm going to have to play something. It'd be a perfect time. I've got Civ Rev on my phone. You're going to have so to like, go into the future really? to get it. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Next question. Uh, Mission number Realm. Oh, wait. That's the same question. The next question comes... Why do we let him not be... Good question. Nate Nova asks, it's Christmas, what are your so top to RPG, and what would you recommend for the Wii? It's our top RPG. He has top five, but that's too many. Just name your favorite RPG. Ever? No, yesterday. Yeah, ever. I, I think I said it a couple weeks ago when we talked a little bit about this. I really liked The Witcher when it came out. And um, I don't know. Maybe I'll play The Witcher. Maybe I'll get Witcher 2 on Steam. Maybe I'll do that. Mm -hmm. I like that period of time when, like, Heretic and Hexen, when it was sort of like the, yeah. the genre mashing mm -hmm. was going on, because I kind of like some of the first-person stuff. That's where I came from on uh, my first PC gaming. Mm -hmm. Some of those still hold up. Is Heretic the, the, the last one, the one that had the Quake engine? I'm sure Heretic I Heretic 2, I think. Heretic. I don't know if that's my More favorite. heretical than before. Yeah. I think it was the title. Most heretical. All right. Heretical? Meh. Next question comes from Swag and Crow, who was also asked many questions here. Do we know? And he's a director. Hi, mm -hmm. Swag. I didn't know that. Yeah. I asked. Uh, oh wait, no, no, not Swag and Crow. I'm sorry, Swag and Crow's not a director. Are you thinking of Crow Game? Yeah, I'm thinking of Jack. Ask the question. Uh, what is your favorite memory from The Office in 2010? Ooh. Probably that first week when Realm dropped, and I read the comments for the first time and realized what it's like to be on the internet. Yeah. That was, uh, oh, wait, that was my least favorite moment of my life. Um, <laughs> favorite moment, probably the LucasArts trip. That was pretty fun. Me and Grit. Oh, yeah. Chilling out. This is for you, buddy. That's not in the office, technically. Shut up. Answer. I enjoyed uh, BlizzCon this year. It was pretty, office pretty rad. Also not, not in the office. In the office. Um, oh, damn it. I think my favorite moments have been during, honestly, the live stream were really fun. And, uh, I don't know, like we got to hang out with, you know, all the other channels and uh, even though I only played for two and a half minutes and it was abysmal, I had a great time uh, chatting with you guys 
and uh, so much fun that we're thinking about doing some live stream stuff ourselves. So, yes, in fact, we, we did the IGAs by the time you watched totally this. That totally leads into this question. I had a personal. And that was a disaster. Christopher Page asks, "What would you do for a live stream and or a podcast?" And I'm like, "Well, well that'd we've, be interesting. We've had some we've had several ideas, but what would you like to see from us in a live stream?" And remember, we can be playing MMOs, we can play with you. Uh, we can do Q and A's in the live streams. So what would you like to see on the live stream? We're yeah. still thinking about doing the guild, right? No, yeah, we are going to do a guild, and um, you know, stay tuned for the next couple of general chats, and we're going to have the finalist names for the guild, and we're going to announce after New Year's. Is that right? What the guild name is going to be? Uh, is that our plan? We don't know. We don't really have a plan. I think uh, I think we're going to announce the general chat before New Year's. Well, so we're next week. So next week's we're going to announce what our guild name is based on your recommendations. But until then, wait a we, minute. Well, we're gonna we talk we about haven't the even given three. them the choices. Okay, next week we're going to give you the top three choices, yes. and then we're going to pick the name when we come back from New Year's. Okay. No, no planning is involved in the show. I, I can't even believe we get to put this. And of course, out. that that was all written down on this piece of sheet of paper, like exactly. Okay. We could have read it, but back no, no. to the. I mean, like, okay. <laughs> can I go buy stuff now? Go buy stuff. Yes, let's Dragons go. Dragons Den, Meltdown mm -hmm. Comics. I'll buy stuff. Merry Christmas. Oh wait, my stuff's here. The show is in shambles. Shit.